Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Overlord. We've got the Reds. Let's head back to our tower. By the way, this is the only way you can go. I really wish they would just let you go back to the halfling place because there's a thing you can grab with your Reds there, but you can't. So, this is where we have to go. <sighs> Salutations! Leader of the fire starters. Oh my god, I hate you. Exploder of Melvin Underbelly. So, if we go down into the dungeon now, <clears throat> we can actually see that there's going to be a little fire area for us because Welcome to the spawning pit, master. The spawning the pit is not only the main source of your tower's power, but it also contains information on your minions. Touch oh. it and see. I forgot about this. Yeah, how many you've spawned, how many you've lost, your corruption level. And over here, reds see the reds. Particularly hardy, so you mustn't let enemies get too close to them, sire. But yeah. use them in a pack, and that's a different story. A story full of flames and burning and screaming. <laughs> ah, it's good to have them back. Maybe I can get a hot meal now. Anyways, I thought we could do something with them here, but I am wrong. <laughs> so we're just going to go back. Unless there wasn't a, no, there wasn't a fire thing. Okay. Anyways, we want to go right back out. <clears throat> I guess we're just going right back to Mellow Hills. Except we're grabbing our fire ones as we go. So now we have more options. Isn't that lovely? Oh, hello. My lord, now you've got rid of Melvin, the sheep are flourishing. Are they now? Take as many as you like, sire. They're breeding faster than I can count them. Oh, more sheepies. Will do, will do. So let's grab... I don't know, like, eight of these guys, and then fill the rest of our party up with these. Oh, apparently we can't kill those sheep. Oh, what's the... Eh. Well, hold on. We want to kill some sheep first. So, the uh, soul that you get from the sheep, I believe, is based on what kills them? I might be wrong. Maybe they only give you... Do they only give you yellows? Okay, never mind. They only give you yellows. Never mind. We don't need to kill any sheep then. Alright, we're all done here. So let's head back to the halfling place. Let's grab that thing that was in the fire. Just because, you know, rewards are nice. Oh, I forgot that this way was open. Oh, we could have been going this way the whole time. Anyway. That's fine. There's... No, there's nothing over there that we need fire for. Well, look at this. Got food back to the village, right? You're a gem. I couldn't have spent another night listening to my grumbling stomach. Yay! You're welcome at the Happy Mule. Anytime. Am I? Because I can't fit through the goddamn door. We are in your debt. Bills all around. Just get them all drunk. Thank you for freeing us. I have a bunch of freed villagers too. All right. I'm gonna name a pumpkin after you. Please don't. I really. Are those creatures for sale? No, they're not. So, uh, look at how useless they are. They're all one of them already died. Ugh. Did everyone respawn? Oh, most of them respawn. I'll never understand this. All right, give me red. Just want to get that money that was left behind. That's all. I want. They didn't. It didn't respawn the ogre, did it? They wouldn't. Okay, good. <laughs> For a second there, I was like, mm -mm. I was about to get real angry. 
Uh, I guess we can get some combat effectiveness while we're here. Treasure. It's almost wasted pumping up the reds. Uh, I guess pumpkins aren't too big of a deal. Send them through here. Typically, the aren't the browns will get uh all the decent stuff anyway, and the reds never pick up uh Oh wait, do reds not pick up armor? They don't. Okay, so the well, no, because nope. What do they? They only pick up certain types of armor. Because uh, there are some reds that are wearing armor and others that aren't. Well, that's annoying in a different way entirely. All right. I hate that you have to come all the way back here. And there's no red spawner here either, so you have to remember to grab reds on their way here. Like, what kind of annoying shit is that? Oh, hello. Alright, there we go. Go get that thing for me, please. Oh. Look at how useless they are! Ugh! My goodness, I hate reds. Alright, y'all done? Good. You choose all. I do choose all. Bring me back money. That's all we came here for. Okay. Now, I believe the next area we want to go to is the forge. Because that's where there's a whole bunch of red stuff that we have to do. I think if you tried to go into the forge before, it wouldn't have... Ooh, or we could go to the fields. The, f the fields were, like, all on fire. Or maybe that's the reason we don't want to take the reds? I can't remember. Either way, we're going to another area. At least we took care of everything here. Because if I forgot this, it would have just been annoying. Did oh, right. People died. Uh, Honestly, I might just grab more browns. Because they're more effective and useful than any of the reds will ever be. And it's a lot easier to get souls for them. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Oh, look, the guy's still wearing Melvin's crown. I wish we could keep him to the end of the game, but he will undoubtedly die. As they are prone to do. Okay, they'll take their sweet-ass time getting that money back to us. Is that really the closest spawner? That's really annoying. Hey, are those creatures for sale? I should ruin you for saying that. Just like you. No, you don't. Okay. Let's see ah, I smell roasted harflin on the breeze. Where the next place to go is. Only good halflings are dead halflings. So this is the fields, right? Let's go ahead and unlock this extra gate for us. Look, 14 out of 15. One of them got stuck somewhere again. Well, all right. Let's... No. Stop. You all can have fun with the sheep later. Are you... Attacking them? All right. We want to get this shortcut. Fantastic. All right. Where are you? Where are you all? I literally have no idea where you are. Oh, there you are. Well, there's some of you. Where the hell did the rest of you go? What? <laughs> Their AI really loves to get stuck. Okay, there we go. 
I guess let's head through the fields and see what, uh... Nope, we're still missing one. One of them is just gone forever. Well, at least until we gate somewhere else. Okay, there's a lot of sheep here. Is it worth it to even go through this area? Oh yeah, I forgot that... Ow. The reds will, uh... Go through the... Oh my god. One of the reds died from a sheep. Nope. They're having a lot of time, aren't they? Look at him. Oh, he's chasing them. Alright, all of them come back to me. Yeah, you only get yellow from them. Okay, good to know. These roots? Oh, I've never seen anything like it. Darn elves can't keep their own forest under control. These roots are strangling our crops. The forest? It's gone crazy. That ain't natural, I'm telling you. I've tried cutting them, setting them on fire. Nothing helps. It's elf magic. I never trusted those 40 year layabouts. Oh. I don't want to do the elven forest right now. It, it's one of my least favorite areas. Just because it's so obnoxious. Alright. Oh, well, let's not do the elven forest then. We can skip that for now. We have a little bit of uh, play with what we're actually going to be taking care of. Ooh. Reds. Reds can remove some fire. And look, there's a red spawner here now. Ah, this is what you need them for. Because we want to get the forge. Lovely. All of you pick this up. And this will let us spend our money, I believe. Which we desperately need, to be honest. We we have a lot of money. And nothing to use it on. Well, here we go. This is how we fix that. I think. I could be wrong. I feel like there's another part to this. That I'm forgetting. Do you want it? Are you guys not taking it? Halflings! Close the gates! Cowardly creatures! Quick, find another route! and decide how to deal with these worthless peons. All right. Go murder them. Oh, there's a spear, dude. Ugh. Oh! Well. That's right. I forgot about that. The other reason I hate reds is because if you're fighting in a fucking hayfield, as soon as a red attacks, all of your browns will die. Because, you know, that's what I want to be dealing with in the middle of all this. God, I hate reds. I forgot how much I hated them, too. Until we started playing this. Don't want to deal with you. Put this down. Are there more halflings? It doesn't look like it. There are more halflings.
All right, let's go grab that uh, forge before we head all the way there. Oh, right, you can set fire to, like, everything. It's really difficult to get them to set fire to things I found. Not, like, on purpose, rather. By accident, they'll absolutely set fire to everything. <laughs> but making them do it uh, by accident, it's just really annoying. Or on purpose, rather. All right. Let's go deliver this thing. Oh, look, there's a bunch more halflings over there. That's not the way we're taking, is it? Ugh. I think that's just the way back to the village. To go that way. So it says 12 are on there. We have two. Oh, right, because one is just stuck in oblivion somewhere. That's right. So are we going right or are we going left? What does your pathing say? Because if we're going left, we're going to have to kill some halflings. Okay, we're going left. Good to know. Alright, kill the halflings. There we go. Ooh, money. I'll take that. I'll take that. And I guess... Yep, it's clear all the way back. Yay, upgrades! I... I think this is how we spend money. <laughs> I could be wrong. Oh. I want to get blues so badly. Blues are fun. Blues are okay. Greens are... Eh. We'll get the greens later. You have retrieved a smelter, sire. More forging options are available. More like forging options have appeared. We just didn't have any before. Let's see what's in the other direction, because I feel like there was something else we could have done in the village. It's to the north, right? Oh, right, the castle. Castle. Oh, all right. Let's open up this path again, just to have it. You and your creatures saved us some work. <laughs> Uh, do we want to do the castle right now? Ooh, what's up here again? Oh no, it's, this is just the, the pretty lookout area. That has a mana font in it. Okay. That house is amazing. Okay. Uh... We want to do the castle now. I feel like we don't. We definitely don't want to do the castle now, actually. Okay, I guess let's return to... Let's return to the tower. See what our options are there. And then I guess we'll head to the elven forest next and go get greens. As much as I hate that option. I think we get both blues and greens from the forest and then we'll make our way to the castle at least i think that's the intended route for this game <laughs> i could be wrong because it's been a while but um yeah okay let's go this way i wonder what keeps their pathing from going back this direction is this just a longer way to go i mean i guess no, it's about the same length as the other direction. Well, let's go check out the forging options. Because we really didn't have any before. I'm trying to stave off going to that elven forest as much as possible. Oh, boring parts of the game are boring. Visit the forge, Dark One, and create weapons and armor truly worthy of an overlord. Okay. 
Wait, where's the forge again? Get out of my way. Oh my god. Am I actually stuck? No. I'm not. If you're feeling in the mood to practice your combat skills, sire. Welcome! Okay. Forge is over here. So I forget what we can make here. Ah, the forge, sire. This place has brought forth weapons that could slay troll kings and armor that could stop a dragon's breath. Okay. Giblet has been promoted to Forge Master. He will show you around. Giblet, huh? The smelter is heating, sire. Please follow Giblet to the Forge Chamber. Alrighty. Let's see what we can do. Here you can forge new items and upgrade existing ones. You can create three types of items. Weapons, helmets, and armor. Mmm. So, we could actually make two of these. Impose your will. This what does a helmet do? Select the material type, sire. It's dependent on the types of smelters you have in your forge. Is it worth it to make steel items, stuff? Weapons, helmets, and armor. The lives of your minions can be used to imbue items. The more you sacrifice, the more powerful the item. Cost and the maximum number of minions you can sacrifice are determined by item and material type. Oh my dear lord, you can sacrifice a lot. Remember, minions are your deadliest weapons. So don't leave home without them. Okay. This is where you can I feel like it's not worth it just yet it's to make things. You have in your forge. Wow. The lives of your minions can be used to imbue items. The more you sacrifice, the more powerful the item. I feel like most of this is late game stuff. The number of minions you can sacrifice are determined by item and material type. I could be wrong. Don't get too carried away. But I feel like Remember it's almost not worth it to do it right now because well, obviously we need minions more than anything else. Of the fire I am very curious about how far we can get carried away with that though. Anyways, let's go to the hills and then we'll go to the forest. Okay. Honestly, I just want all browns. There we go. Go forth. Kill all the sheep. I totally forgot that you can imbue your weapons with them. That means we need a whole lot more sheep. Maybe I'll just farm sheep for a little bit in, a, in one of the episodes. Or not in an episode, because that may actually be more annoying than it's worth. But like, just farm some sheep, you know. Get some souls. Because they did say they're frolicking and there's a lot of them. Wow. Effective. Okay. Uh, which way am I going? I guess this way. That's right, because this drawbridge is now down. And we want to take this one. Go over. We can kill more sheep. Very effectively. Let's let them have a little bit more fun. Get them a little bit more upgraded. Hopefully. This beginning area, this hub area, has a lot of opportunities to upgrade your minions. Unfortunately, like, keeping them upgraded is tough, but... Yeah. Oh, that's right. There's rams. There we go. Kill. Kill. Oh. 
I think they know that like once you get the forge, you'll want to imbue stuff like almost immediately. So that's why they give you all this prime opportunity to just get a ton of brown souls or essence or whatever it's called. Bah. Okay. That's enough for now. 172? Sounds good to me. Oh, wow, really? Okay, still haven't caught that sheep. They move a lot faster when you control them. Alright, anyways. Let's head into the forest. These roots? Oh, I've never seen anything like it. And hopefully this will go easier than I remember it being. Because I remember the forest being incredibly annoying and very, very, very easy to get turned around. Oh, God. Really? It's going to force me to take reds. Ugh. Even the reds are the worst. Darn elves can't keep their own forest under control. Darn the elves. Like darning s are you kidding me? Can I summon them from here? Okay, good. I was about to get real angry that like that area was locked off without having reds to go to it, and I was like, what? Okay, good. Good. <sighs> well, let's get rid of this. Yeah, this is definitely the intended progression of the game. And I do believe we'll get both greens and blues here. Or maybe just blues. I could be wrong. But I think you get both. Maybe? <laughs> You choose all. I I mean, yes, I do. Evanite Forest was once filled with elven magic. Creature and plant existed harmoniously amid leafy canopies and sun dappled pools. <laughs> now it is dank, dark, corrupted. Ooh, I like what they've done with the place. Ooh, a unicorn. Okay. Trespasses on this once burdened soil. Keyword being once. All right, can't go over there yet either. Oh, I remember all this. So we go straight down the middle first. Oh. What creature has the dreaming brought forth? Alas, Obera is truly sickened. Elves, even dead ones, can speak telepathically to all magical beings, sire. Lazy creatures. It must prove that it is not a manifestation made flesh. If you are of the earth and not of the mind, seek out the one horn beasts. Once they bestowed healing. But now they crave the blood of living creatures. All living creatures. Blood! Blood! Release them from their pain and return here. Only then shall you learn more of Evernight's sorrow. Okay. So, unicorns have gone crazy. Can't go past them either. They've invisible walled us. Look at all these dead people. Dead halflings, dead humans. Maybe dead elves. Yeah, so these unicorns. Soppy, overrated pit ponies. Elves are despised. Not as much as bloody unicorns. Ah, I see why they play. Get on it. Oh, 
Ooh. Good going. We actually killed that rather well. Look at these tree roots. Well, that'll be a problem. Although your imposing form can enter water, your minions cannot. Well, they can, but they will drown in a rather amusing way. You must find them a bridge across. <sighs> oh my god, I hate the bridge mechanic! I hate the bridge mechanic. All right. You want to charge me? Oh, it kicked me. You darn horse. Stop running away. You must die. Ooh. One of them got a unicorn horn. Alright. Let's make sure that we grab this. And we want to... Make sure we turn this as well. Okay. I think that's all we needed over here. God, I hate the water mechanic. Because if you try to drag him across, sometimes they'll just walk right into it. It's really annoying. The anger spell. I forgot how you change spells. Like this, apparently. The beasts are slain. Alas, it is only a brief light that shines within this darkness. God, you guys are annoying. They're emo, uh, they're emo elves, by the way, if you hadn't guessed. Emo elves. Aren't all elves kind of emo, though? If you think about it. The answer is yes. Yes, they are. Look at these weird rat-looking things. Really? Can y'all actually path correctly? All right. Should be more of them that spawn up. Here we go. There we go. What are you talking about? Okay, nothing over there. Just a weirdo elf hanging out. Oberon Green Haze once traveled the lands, vanquishing the At last he returned, our great hero lost his taste for battle. When the dwarven invaders came, he would not fight. Oberon's blade became dull, his bowstring brittle, 
and he would not wake from his slumber. Around him grew this tree, swaddling him in its branches. Then the dreaming came. <laughs> Story time. Yeah, we gotta kill Oberon. So we can't go that way. That is all locked off. Can't go kill Oberon either. He's kind of locked there. Ain't that interesting? Oberon gave form to his blackest dreams. They drove out the invaders. The tree grew over the place where the invaders entered our lands, but its roots drew power from the forest, corrupting all within. So basically, we've got to take out the root system. And the way you do that is by defeating these root pod things, where the roots meet the ground. So there's a lot of these here. This is part of the reason. What is happening? The tree. I feel it quivering. The shield is weakening. You must destroy the so part of the reason why I hate this area. Not really. This is part of the reason why I don't like this area, because man oh man, is it confusing to find some of those root pods. Like, it's almost non-linear, and yet is more linear than it should be both at the same time, and I, I'm not entirely sure how that's possible. Ooh, we want that. We'll get that later. Anyways, follow the roots. There's fire here. Can't go that way because we don't have green. Oh! We are in luck. They have resistance to the poisonous plants in Evernight. You must find their land. Yeah, we gotta find their lair. <laughs> Little rivalry is kind of funny. Yeah, we gotta traverse all that so we can get to there with the greens and take it out eventually. I don't remember how. Shift lock. Oh, it's about to explode. Oops. Here you go. Come back here. Easy peasy. All right. Let's have all of you go over there. So you all path correctly. Sometimes they'll like come to you while you're in the water too. All right. Let's see if you can make it there. Come on. Make it over there. Drop it. Oh, well. You gave your life for the cause. No, oh my god. I... Uh, stop going into the shallow water. I really wish you could just they could auto path because watch they'll just be stuck in there now all right get to me all right I don't know who died I think it was just Browns oh 
Okay. So there's a bunch of poison pods there. <laughs> this red is about to give his life. All right, come back here. All right. Goodbye, red. I knew ye not well. Yeah. Effective. Is there something in the water? I think it is. Okay, so we can't do anything with it yet anyway. What? Oh, damn it. That doesn't respawn, does it? It might. Oh, I think they do respawn. That one respawned. Okay. I keep letting go of shift way too early. Alright, get over here. Leave it right in the middle. Get out of there. Why would you run into the water? I just... I just... Are they giving me blue? Does the game assume I have blues? But no. This is why I hate their pathing. Like, I'm not telling you to go into the water. I'm telling you to go up the vines. But there's water under the vines, of course. So if I get them anywhere close, man, oh man, do they have issues. Okay. Get this over here. Oh. Oh, no. Well, goodbye, brown. Yeah, they will revive each other. In a horrific display of necromancy. It might almost be easier just to kill them. Oh, look, there's the greens. Oh man, oh man. These guys gonna die? Are they gonna path smart? Oh, they path normally this- Oh wait, hold on. They left all the stuff though. Left all of the goodies. Well, some of them. Alright, anyways. Let's go get some greens. Oh, they went into that cave, it seems. Ooh, an object. I, like objects. I do believe we want to get this right now. This will let us have more total, I think. I think this will let us get to 20. I can't remember. All right, there we go. <laughs> ah, my mana increased. Lovely. Okay. Well, we've done a lot in this episode. And next time, we're going to go get ourselves some greens. I'm... Can you... Can you please... What are you even... Just get in there. Leave! My god. Anyways, thank you all for watching. And uh, I'll see you guys next time when we go and get some greens. But for the moment, I do not want to start another dungeon <laughs> just to get to that point. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye. Leader of the fire starters. Exploder of Melvin Underbelly. Wielder of Steel. Merciful Quagner of the Grand...